I mean, this is a person you spend a lot of time with. I would say the number one property you need probably is respect. It is okay if you do not always see eye to eye or if you don't, you know, want to go to the movies with them every weekend or whatever. Like those things are okay. Some of my closest professional relationships that have been the most productive have just been ones that are rooted in respect and trust. And yeah, like we were not friends outside the office, like in any way, shape or form, but that trust and respect was there and we're out there killing it together, right? Winning together. And I would say that's the thing you have to check with your gut a little bit. The finding part, and we talked about that a little bit already, but, you know, I I think that Breen is exactly right, which is you have to first figure out what is it you're actually solving for, right? And, you know, Stanley, you, you know, you said, hey, you know, you don't think you're the, you know, the person maybe have the ideas and, you know, the peroxide and whatever. Well, that, that means you actually need a great out of the box product thinker. That's what you need. 